Today we're going to do a case study looking at functional medicine versus modern medicine. It is an irritable bowel syndrome and fatigue case. We'll look at the traditional modern medical approach first. The patient was a 27-year-old female with an 11-year history of irritable bowel syndrome and fatigue. Let's do the math here. The patient is 27. She's suffered for 11 years which means this whole issue started at age 16. So from age 16 to 27, she had to figure out every bathroom between her home and her school, or her home and her job. For those of you who have suffered from irritable bowel syndrome, you know what a nightmare that can be. She had seen four different doctors. The medical testing consisted of an upper and lower GI study and a colonoscopy, all of which were found to be negative for any pathologies. Treatment consisted of prescription medications. The results were poor. The functional medicine approach started with an extensive history and review of medical records. The functional medicine practitioner ordered a digestive stool analysis and an allergy blood test. Two bacterial pathogens were found to be affecting her intestines. The medical literature clearly linked these two pathogens to diarrhea disease. In addition, her allergy test revealed a sensitivity to gluten and rice. The patient was prescribed a natural pharmaceutical that helped eradicate the two bacterial pathogens and was placed on an elimination diet, addressing the rice and gluten sensitivity. After one month, she was symptom-free. Functional medicine did in one month what modern medicine couldn't do in 11 years because they didn't remove the triggers. Symptoms are visible represented on the top of this picture, the tip of the iceberg. Arthritis, diabetes, heart disease, autoimmune diseases, cancer and obesity, and of course, fibromyalgia. The underlying causes are not so easy to see. They require an in-depth health history, metabolic assessment forms, and if necessary, advanced testing. If you are suffering with fibromyalgia, please consider functional medicine as an option.